I just, I really like making stuff, like, um, a lot of 3D stuff, because 2D stuff, it's like, well, it's there, but you can't move it, touch it, interact with it as much. So like sculpture and fashion design just really called to me. <laughs> as she makes a new dress from her own pattern, Denver Online High School senior, Lamise Witt, loves to design unique pieces, ultimately wanting to become a fashion designer. But like here, it's like, you know, like Air Force jumpsuits, but it's still got space stuff like rings and two-tone. I really like two-tone if you. I guess my style is like, it's pretty futuristic, but it's like the Jetsons futuristic, where it's like still kind of retro, it's still got touches of the past. But getting to this point took a somewhat futuristic approach to education too. Trading in traditional education with one that was personalized to her needs and nurtured her creativity. Um, I was having a lot of like mental health issues and the school I was going to before wasn't giving me like a 504 or anything to help support my learning. So my mom was like, we're done with this. We need a school that will actually like fit for you, care for you, like try. So Lamis landed at Denver Online for her senior year of high school. It was really great because even though it's an online school, I felt like I was getting more support than I had ever gotten in like non-online schools. And she has even started college art classes through Denver Online's concurrent enrollment program. Taking studio art at Front Range Community College along with college English and marketing classes as well. Um, so concurrent enrollment, it's worked for me like so well because I, like, college is expensive <laughs> and any way that it can be cheaper is great. And getting a head start in college will help her with her next step at the School of the Art Institute of Chicago. Um, it's the acceptance letter to SAIC. It's gonna be um, a bachelor's in fine arts with emphasis on fashion design. She dreams of making it to the city that never sleeps. Of course, I'll start in Chicago, but then hopefully I'll move to New York because I I just love it there. It's so nice. And maybe one day she'll even make her mark at New York Fashion Week. Yeah, that would be really amazing. Yeah, I mean, it would just be great to be backstage and see how everything goes down and eventually become a part of it.